वेलकम बैक टू दिस चैनल इट्स मी एलेक्ट्रो डी आई वाई हियर सो टुडे आई एम एक्चुअली हैविंग अ वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग टॉपिक दैट आई हैव सीन इन द पास्ट फ्यू डेज हियर वी आर गोन बी टॉकिंग अबाउट क्रॉम्पटन वीव्स एंटी डस्ट सीलिंग फैंस एज यू नो वी हैव अवर एंटी डस्ट अवेंसर एंटी डस्ट एंड मेनी मोर एंटी डस्ट सीलिंग फैंस अदर डे गोइंग थ्रू एमेजॉन आई हैव सीन मेनी नेगेटिव रिव्यूज ऑन द एंटी डस्ट सीलिंग फैंस Prefer mostly the Crampton, Avancer, and how the anti-dust. Basically, people don't know how the anti-dust works. What's its actual principle? So, before that, let me show you a few pictures of those reviews, one-star reviews, which people have put just because they don't know what's anti-dust. Here you go. With me today, I have Saurabh Biswas from Kolkata. He also has a YouTube channel named Saurabh Biswas. So I'll let him tell you the rest. So as I don't have an anti-dust ceiling fan, I thought to let him into the video so that he could also give some of his valuable information to you guys. Saurabh, hop in. So hello guys, I'm Saurabh Biswas. I have a YouTube channel regarding unboxing and installation of fans and accessories. So. Thank you, Electro DIY, for letting me a part of your video and showcase my anti-dust server. So recently, I got a message from the YouTuber Electro DIY that in Amazon or Flipkart, there are many negative reviews regarding the anti-dust fans, especially from Crompton or whatever might be, especially the Crompton ones. Uh, so today, I want to give you a proof that whether the anti-dust technology works or not. Since I have an Aura anti-dust. Let me show you the box. So this is the box of the Aura. As you can see, it's clearly mentioned anti-dust, and the color is dusky brown. So this is the fan box and the blade box, as you can see. So and the blade is also dusky brown. So nobody can claim that this is wrong blade or whatever might be. So generally speaking, I am using this Aura anti-dust for around two to two point five years. and i have faced no issues regarding this fan means um, i have regularly cleaned the fan no issues with the paint no issues with cleaning and regarding the paint also the polish of the paint is also still good it's good as new so i want to today the fan is dusty so i want to clean it and i want to give a proof whether this anti dust technology works or not uh, to those persons who give negative comments to those anti dust fans so as you can see this is my crompton aura so the fan is now in dusty condition as i have shown you the pics so this this is the condition of the fan so now let me just grab a towel here so as you can see this is the dusty blade of the aura anti dust so let's clean the fan So as you can see this blade we cleaned with one stroke here the dust is almost gone as you can see here there are some dust because i didn't stop my fingers here and then i apply pressure here to the places why i where i applied means where i grip the blade properly it is cleaned as new so as you can see here here is one dust mark you may wipe it but this part is totally cleaned as new see the groove it's totally clean dust new so this is the feature of the anti dust fan if this was a non anti dust fan then the dust will be as if you just rub the blade uh, if you rub the hand on the blade like this the dust will get scattered here and there but 
it will not be shiny like this blade so this is the features of anti-rust fan especially from Crompton I am showing you a basic example so take suppose this is a dusty blade as you can see now it's very it's accumulated with dust so just put your finger like this just grab the fan and now you can see here this part is totally cleaned where I shoved my finger so as you can see the blade is dirty but the, the this part is clean so this is the basic feature of anti-rust you can also just wipe off the dirt from the blade tips and there is no residue this is the main fact the anti-rust blade don't leaves a residue like the non-anti-rust fans whatever available in the market if you have a non-anti-rust fan you have to just clean it using means this this dust also it is very hard to remove from the non-anti-rust fans after wiping with a cloth also and you have to wash the blades or use Mr. Muscle or whatever might be you have to use and regarding the anti-rust model you don't have to use so much detergent and stuff just one dry cloth and it's clean and if you just want these marks to get out means go up from the blade then wet the cloth and just wipe it so let me show you the two blades the avancer versus the aura so this blade is totally clean so let me turn on the flash so as you can see this blade is totally cleaned and this is the brand new avancer blade so as you can see both the blades are looking like brand new there is no such dust marks on the old fan this this blade as you can see this brown blade so this is the features of anti-dust so this one is the avancer blade and this is the aura blade so aura blade have a deep groove in their blades but not the avancer the avancer have a curve curvy design as you can see so this is the real thing between a anti-dust blade versus a dusty anti-dust blade <laughs> what i will say so these are the two blades new and old it's th this blade is completely looking like new and it's not looking old. so so let's flip over to electro diy's channel and see as you guys can see this is the dusty high speed decora blade so the fan hasn't been clean in the while in a while uh, it's it isn't as dusty as the aura it's a bit less but it's good enough for comparison versus a no, you know an anti dust versus non anti dust as you can see the amount of dust that's there now we will clean the fan single stroke medium pressure so as you can see we have uh, bit of dust left okay so as a close up you can see I didn't touch the deco so it still has the dust but as I was cleaning most of, some of the dust was clean but the rest you can see still the marks are there because this is a non anti dust fan the paint is matte finish anti dust is you know gloss finish you can see the tips how dusty it is even after one wipe cannot remove that you need two to three wipes and a wet clean dry clean is easily able to be done on anti-dust whereas on a non-anti-dust it's not easy in non-anti-dust you have to apply more effort for cleaning the fan but in anti-dust it's not much so people should know this anti-dust does not mean that it does not attract dust anti-dust will attract dust but when it comes to cleaning that's easier that's the thing so let me show a small demonstration I will run my finger through the blade like Saurabh did first time you can see with me low pressure the dust just settled on each other now with more higher pressure you can see dust is on my finger but it, it, it didn't, didn't get cleaned as the aura anti-dust you can see dust is still settled even after applying more pressure and it is spread to the cleaner part of the blade so you can see with the flash how I have done it so uh, as I have previously told you Anti-dust fans are easy to clean, non-anti-dust needs a little bit more effort. They're worth the money. 
the anti-dust fans. The extra money that companies charge, especially Crampton, Aura and Avance are the best anti-dust fans in the market. So let's compare the old high speed blade which I have cleaned really well versus the single stroke cleaned high speed decora blade. You can see there's a night and day difference in cleaning because the non anti dust blade doesn't get as cleaned easy as easily as the you know anti dust blades as you have seen Saurudeep's results. So here I have this high speed decora will need to be cleaned with a bit of Mr. Muscle and everything. Anti dust fans are really good. They are effortless to clean. So like if you want to buy you are always welcome non anti dust also you can buy depends on what is your requirement and your design so guys thanks for watching this video please like and share comment and don't forget to subscribe shorodi biswas and electro diy for more amazing content like this